Today in ICANN has Armory, how to replace the side straps on a mask if you have to take out the rivets. Okay, so I have here a mask from one of my local coaches, and uh, dummy that I am, emphasis on the duh, I forgot to shoot the explanation about this part here before I put the rivets out. So the issue was uh, the Velcro had worn out and it was no longer holding the straps in. I made a new strap for the cross the back, but the side ones weren't there to hold. I was going to try and sew, sew them on, but my hands getting weak and I'm going to go numb and I was having a hard time getting in this figured okay just drill the rivets out so the straps are held on my rivets and you can see now I got the rivets out and I'm going to patch it a bit but I had to drill the rivets out and then I'm going to mount the uh, side tabs which then have new velcro and it'll hold the thing on so let me show you uh, taking the rivets out and we'll go from there okay so the problem we have here is getting the rivets out and I need you see, this tab is totally worn out. I replace it. It'd be much better to replace it than try and sew over it. So I got to drill these two rivets out, and then we put new rivets in. So this is a relatively small drill bit. Uh, I'm not sure what size it is. Don't remember, but it's it's just big enough to make a relatively small hole. I don't want to make a gigantic hole in the um, in the drill plate. So here we go. Keep drilling out. Oops. Something right there. Okay, this pirate came out already. So there's the interior. We played the washer. And there's the rest of the rivet. I don't know if it's coming out or not yet. We'll keep trying. Oh, okay. It's out there. Okay, and it came out. So you can see right there's where it was. It's gone. So I'm to focus and try to work around my camera here. Try it again. Okay, there's that. There it goes. What I'm really drilling here is just destroying the rivet's ability to hold in place. That came out with the front side. Front side's gone. Tab's gone. Now I can replace that. So let's see. You see how big the holes actually were? Uh, they're very large. Let's do the other side. If I can see it. Yeah. Okay. You see drilling from the inside, don't have to worry about going through the entire rivet, just got this, uh, this washer loose. There it goes. Okay. Washer's coming up. Let's see if I get it out here. Okay, washer's out. Other side. That's loose. That's out. The, the whole river came out, as a matter of fact. The interior one here gone. Pull this outer side off. The other one is gone already. Oh, there's the pad gone. Okay, part of it's still there. Let's see if I can push it out with the drill. There it goes. So, <clears throat> get out of there. And then go, there we go. So now, the rivets are clear, and I can put the uh, new uh, tabs in, standby. Okay, so I already got one on so I could practice. So here's the other one. So I have a, 
length of Vel uh, the Velcro here is actually longer it needs to be to fold this over a little bit. So it's comfortable to the back of the guy's head. Plus it also, it's over here a bit. So first I'm gonna use marker, I'm gonna put the hole. So line up here. Let's see, oops. Fold it over. So there's one hole. Please them went through there or not. It's a good dent, but I'll do this a different way. I have one of my rivets. Let's see, put that there. Push that through against it. So we can push through it, or at least make a dent on it. Okay. So I see where it's going to be. Right there. Now, how do I get through that? I could push through with this, but the problem is I don't want to get this in through. I got to get this in through. So I'm going to use a knife. It's going to basically push this aside real quick and kind of bore a hole through it. So this is just pushing. This cuts through. This cuts through. I'm trying to turn this back and forth to kind of widen the hole. Okay, you're going to go through. Very carefully, you're going to push through. It's kind of hard to see what I'm doing here. Pushing through both sides there. And kind of turning it to kind of bore the hole a little wider. So I know then it's going to go through both sides. Quick test. Okay, first, small side does go through. I know that. So the hole is through both. But again, I need the other side to go through, so let's try to widen it a little bit. It's starting to go through. Okay. So let's make it through. Let's see that side. And this side here. Okay, so this is how I want it to go through. With the expandable side on this side. This is the inside of the other rivet. Now, I'm not ready to put it on yet. Because now washers so for each one I'm going to use three different three washers There's two relatively large ones to make sure we cover the holes up and then a small one on the top on the outside to make sure it stays better so we'll do one side first this is inside this is the um, hook side because the other one has the has the uh, fluffy side down let's see so this is gonna go through first one on there as it falls off <laughs> go through there in through the hole here and put on the second big washer to cover the hole and the smaller top one primarily just to make sure it's gonna center proper stay still and just to hold make sure everyone's in the right place put that through that's gonna fall through first we'll do that there that way it's that way it's in the same in the correct spot. Through again, boom, boom. And now, you can see how it looks. And now, rivet gun. And squeeze it. 
Okay, that's good. Here's the old mandrel coming out. And there it's in. Get a couple of washers. On the side. And repeat. So, again, put the big washer from the hole was. Make sure it's going to go through both sides here. Okay, it's going through. Come on. I see you trying. Through layer one. It's kind of hard when it's hidden by the fold. And I'm trying to do the shoot, so let me change position here a little bit. You can't see it because I gotta be able to do this, but I'm trying to make it go through both layers of the Velcro. There's one. Okay, there's two. Oh, now it's two, two layers. Now this particular one, a little more difficult because I'm also going through the leather here. The hardest part is actually find the right length of rivet. So that's in. Now the fun part, can I keep this compressed down to the point where I can make sure that the mandrel grabs the top washer, gotta push it. It's kind of hard when, it's, when you're doing one handed. Small little stages. Looking good. Okay. Break off. Okay. Man, we're stuck it out later. But there we are. And now the uh, rivets in, the straps in, and I can give this back to the coach, and he can use the safety. And that is how I replace the side straps using rivets for the back strap. Happy armoring.